Jim Morrison with this great saying, I wish a spectacular morning to worthy judges, admirable teachers and my friends. I, Sukhmandeep Kaur, stand before you from Government Senior Secondary Smart School Rupalo to share my views about drug abuse. As we all know, access of anything can be dangerous. The same way, addiction of any kind can hamper the quality of life of an individual. The phrase states that addiction is a family disease, as one person uses and the whole family suffers. It's true in all its essence, as the addict does not merely suffer, but the people around him suffer too. However, that doesn't mean they can't be helped or cured. Addiction is curable and we must not give up on the person who is addicted. Rather, help them out for a better life. Different people get addicted owing to different reasons. I'm going to talk about some major reasons. The first one is loneliness. Many people take drugs to overcome the feeling of loneliness. Many a times they feel that they have no one to share their joys and sorrows with. And they eventually take drugs to get rid of this feeling. Secondly, competition. Growing competition in schools, colleges and at work leads to pressure, which is often difficult to handle. To handle this pressure, many people turn to drugs. The third one is family and relationship problems. A lot of people have problems in their family. For them, drug abuse seems to be an easy way to get rid of that stress due to those problems. Youngsters particularly try to tackle their relationship problems by way of using drugs. The fourth and last one is genes. It's often seen that a person's genes also play a significant role in him or her turning an addict. Although it's difficult but not impossible to give up drugs, one can overcome this problem with great determination and strong willpower. I would like to share some views of mine that can help to curb this problem. Firstly, eat healthy. Your mental as well as physical health deteriorates due to heavy intake of drugs. In order to replenish the lost nutrients, it's advised that you should take a healthy diet. Secondly, take exercise. Physical activities such as jogging, dancing, swimming, yoga, etc. promote the growth of endorphins, also known as the happy hormones. All these activities are suggested to get rid of drugs. We can say that drug abuse is a grave problem, especially common among the youth these days. It's not good for them who are addicted to it as well as the ones related to them. Remember, there are so many ways to handle problems such as anxiety, fear, heartbreak, depression, etc. Not only drugs. To conclude, I would say that drugs take you to the hell, disguised as hell. Thanks a lot for listening to my views.